Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Bean. Welcome to my channel and today I have an interesting one for you guys again. Today we're taking a look at Excalibur Arthur, but this time paired up with Eleven, Stranger Things uh, collab character. And yeah, she's a beast in her own right, so we're not even counting her with uh, Arthur passive yet, but her passive increases the hero's damage dealt against enemies by 40%, remaining HP decreases by 10% for each skill use. So basically, she does so much extra damage and that's not even including Arthur's uh, passive, which real quick, he increases the max HP by 30% for all of our allies and their damage dealt to enemies by 20% if, all, uh, if every ally in the battle is human. Which is why we run the full human team of Excalibur Arthur. He is the best human support. And you know who else is human? The one, of course, need I say more. And then we also have Death Pierce in the back. So if we do crit, we do extra damage. And he's also human, just in case one of our units does go down, we don't lose Excalibur Arthur passive. But alright, but as we get loaded into this first match, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. We're currently on the road to 900 subs now, which is insane. Huge thank you. We just hit like 800 like a day or two ago. We're currently at 816 subscribers, and I believe this is a real player. Uh, but yeah, if you're new, consider subscribing. Uh, and if you enjoy today's video... Uh, nice, it's a player. If you enjoyed today's video, also consider leaving a like. I'd really appreciate it. It does help me out a ton. But now, let's get to the main reason. Let's start working on... On Liz. He might be using a Void Food. I don't think so, though. Shh! Es Escanor's just gonna... If we crit... Oh my god, dude, look at that. We just one-shotted Liz. We could easily kill Liz next turn, 100%. And we put up a taunt so he can't target anyone else. So let's see, if he's smart, he'll probably put up a shield. Oh, is he double ranking up? Oh, okay, no. Hmm. Rank up Escanor. Shield, yeah, I figured, I figured. Yep, yeah, hold on. You know what? I'll do this. Uh, I'll do the... The AoE. And then single target. That should be enough to... Break. So this AoE will just finish off the shield, and this should 100% kill the Liz. No, no doubt in my mind. Yeah, 68,000 damage. However, he does have a bunch of Escanor cards, and if he's smart, he should go for my... Oh, we have Sorry on the back. That's interesting. If he's smart, he would go for Excalibur Arthur. You see that? Scared he's gonna do double gold cards? Yeah. Well... Wow. He's going for Escanor, why? Why would you even kill? Why would you go for Escanor? He's not the threat. Excalibur Arthur is the main the main reason that we're doing this much damage. You you just messed up, I think. Oh yeah, hold on. I think so. Uh, we can get some nice merges here, and we'll do some decent damage on the Gelter. Yeah, look at that! Oh my god. Crit! Arthur, please! Kill that Gother! Yes! Dude, let's go! He loses Gother passive, and he doesn't merge ults. That's fantastic. We win. Let's go, dude. Thank you for going for my Escanor. Uh, that honestly just won us the match. There is no way you one-shot my, um, my Arthur. There's no chance. Yeah, no chance. You only have a level 1 next turn? Or, you for yeah. Easy. Alright, that's easy dub. Let's go, dude. First match against the real player and we win. And the reason I'm so confident is because I'm 5-6 and Arthur's ult has detonate. So this is more than enough damage. And let's just move a card and also do this. We can get 11's ult next turn just in case he doesn't leave. But this should probably one shot. Alright, it doesn't, but 11, clean it up. Thank you. If he was 6-6 six, six, though, my Arthur, we would have won. And now he only has a Sario. Uh, he's not going to 1v3 my, my human team. He could try. But yeah, good guy. Uh, good game to Hiro, Hiro Mashi. It's going for 11. Okay. My 11. She is 6-6. Six, six. Her ultimate is also basically a full heal, but since it's been a while, I'll read it. 
Inflicts damage equal to 760% of attack on one enemy and restores the HP of all allies by 40% the damage dealt. 6-6 six, six, by the way. But honestly, yeah. I think she's going to one-shot here. Not only is she boosting her pass or her attack because of her passive, we're also getting an extra increase. Look at that. 146,000 damage, dude. Oh my... Alright, this game actually went pretty well. The main theme was supposed to be Eleven and Excalibur Arthur, and as you saw there, we did it just exactly as planned. But I, I, I'm impressed. This team, this team is fun. So give me a second, and I'll be back with uh, the next opponent on the line. Alright, I think we have a player here. We have been, I have skipped like ten matches, all bots. But well, hopefully we have a player. Um, I think. Just do that, I guess. Oh, yeah, I was a player. <laughs> okay. Well, wow. Really, dude? Why did you have to leave after it took me? I've literally skipped like 10 plus matches, and the first player I find, he leaves. Oh, well, it's fine. I'll be back once we have the next game then. All right, I think we might have a player here, at least I hope. I'm honestly getting tired of skipping all these matches. Probably like match 15. Um, Please? Please be a player? Hold on. Give me something back. I think it is. Okay, good. All right, this is good. This is good. I think it's a player. We'll find out anyways towards the end if we do win or lose at the winning screen or the end screen. Hmm. What do you use? Okay. Use double taunt for some reason. I don't know why. Like, actually, I don't know why. We'll do that. We'll get ult. You should have saved the taunt. Does he have another taunt, though? As long as you don't rush Estorosa ults, then I will not ult with Escanor. Oh, you didn't. Good. Rushed ultimate with... Um, Droll, but that's fine. I won't uh, be. I won't be able to be petrified with. Uh, what's his name? Droll, so that's good. So he's ulting of Droll, okay. Um, do we. No, no way. Yeah. Basically, no damage. I'm assuming a taunt? Oh, he's going for 11, okay. Is this a bot? Why would you do that? He's a DLF immune. I don't know. I guess we'll, yeah, I guess we'll find out. It could be a player. I thought it was a player. Um, let's do that. That's going to 100% one shots that melee. Even if he doesn't, the death damage will. Yeah, okay. That should kill. Please go for Jewel. Oh, you went for Estorosa. Man, this is not going to do as much damage. Actually, no. My 11 is 6-6. Six, six. Okay. Okay, I think it is a player. Yeah, there's a bit of lag. Uh, Edward. Edward. Going for Arthur. But honestly, let's see 11. Let's see if 11 can do some damage. Um, we'll weaken you up with this. And then do double 11 cards. Please, 11, can you finish it up? Maybe. Oh yeah, 100%. <laughs> Disgusting. Okay, we'll find out right now if it was a player or not. I think it is. Yeah, there's lag. Please be a player. Please. Nice, it was. Thank you. Oh, okay. I literally, that literally took me 15 plus matches of skipping matches to find this player. Just nothing but bots. But alright. That was the third match technically. But basically the second. Because the second one that we faced, the guy quit. But I'll be back once we have another one. Alright, 
Nice. Literally the next game after, we have another player. Is it the same guy? It's not. Who's using a tank the team? Alright. This could be tricky. Oh. He quit. Man. Why do you leave? You The game hasn't even started. Okay. Oh well. <sighs> Hopefully it doesn't take me that long to find another match. But I'll be back once we have another player. Okay. Thank you. Finally, man. This is... Oh. We have another player here, I believe. I honestly don't even care who we face, but it's a Amelia team, okay. Um, that's interesting. Oh, dude, can you guys stop leaving? Man, all right, I'll be back once again. All right, please, I beg of you, do not leave the match. Why are you guys leaving? Okay, you're using a glue eater team. You should not leave. And your CC is pretty high. Okay, you better stay. Mm, yeah, you better stay. Let's do that. Alright, put you there. Give me some Escanor cards. Nice. Nice. I can get Arthur ult. Hopefully he starts rushing his, uh, some of his ults as well. What's he going to do? Double rank up into who? Double rank up into Escanor or double rank up into Saria? Typical glue eater strategy. Look at this. No skill what no no, no skill whatsoever required. He's just going to go for the level 3 bonk. And he kills. Okay. I hate Escanor. I actually hate Escanor. Did you merge a gold? This this game this game is this game's dumb. Oh, hold on, Escanor, please kill his Escanor. Oh, oh wait, never mind. This game's amazing. Oh yeah, get out of here, dude. You're dead. You have Amelia in the back, please do. Uh, not Amelia, I mean Liz, because if you do, you lose Gother passive. You, okay, it's over. We win. Oh, thank you. I was actually going to be so mad if we lost. Escanor is such a beast, man. I am one-shotting your sorry, y'all. Oh. No. Please. No, no way he kills my uh, Escanor. No chance. Okay, yeah, we win. Good. Oh, okay, that was that was still cl that was close. Let's ult you into next Tuesday, and then uh, Power Strike, I guess. We'll, we'll waste this Power Strike card with uh, 11. 100% Escanor one-shots to Saria, the kid. I'm sorry, Saria, but you gotta go. Nice, and that means we one-shot another one of your units as well. Death Pierce, okay, good, we win. Okay. Now, oh my, 40,000. Look, that's 40,000 damage type disadvantage from 11, and we're missing uh, Arthur's passive. And I'm pretty sure... Oh, no, he's still here. Okay, good. Oh my. Yeah, he left. Get out of here, dude. Absolutely disgusting ranking up Escanor twice to get that gold. But we came out with the dub. That uh, doesn't make me happy. So yeah, I'll be back with, I believe, the next opponent. I'll probably do two more. So yeah, I'll be back. Alright, I think I think we have a player. What is this? What are you running? What are you running? I honestly don't know. Um, it could be a player. I guess we'll find out. Let's just do that. Haunt out for two turns. He could just petrify me. Depending on this play, we'll find out if it's a bot or not. He's going to rush Gother ult. If he rushes Gother ult, it's probably a player. Yeah, it's a player. He moved cards. Do you think we have enough damage to kill Gelther? Which one's the power strike? That's the power strike. Escanor, please crit. Oh my, we win. We win. Let's go, dude. Gelther's gone. He loses Gelther passive, and then we also have ults with... Oh, we don't have ults with Escanor, that's fine. But the match is over. 
We still have a taunt up as well, so he can petrify my... Uh, what's his name? Arthur? But he won't be able to petrify my Escanor next turn. Granted, he does have res now. But, oh, they got this team is so good. You see what happens? It's the full human team. Is he going to petrify? I'm assuming he's petrifying. No. Okay. But... I'll do that. I'll do that. And then... Wait, so this we get double ults, but you'll probably just um, what's it called? He'll just petrify my Arthur next turn. He can't stun or petrify my Escanor, so that's a one shot, anyways. He's gonna go for the kill. No way, right? My Arthur's too tanky. Yeah, look at that damage. Actually, like he's still hitting pretty hard, but please survive. Nice. Yeah, he's going to petrify Arthur. That's fine. Alright, we win. Um, I think. Smurge you. Ult you. That should one-shot you once. Hopefully, one-shots you twice. And then, I guess we'll do this AoE card of 11. Escanor, please, I need you to one-shot. Draw your 6-6. But he's super tanky. Never mind. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead twice. Good. Oh my. 11. Calm down. So as long as Arthur's still alive, his passive's still going to be working. So I'm assuming he's probably going to go for Arthur. Yeah, okay. No, he didn't even kill. Nice. Did he, tell me you went for 11. Okay, we win. We have ults with 11 and she's 6-6. Six, six. I don't know if he underestimated that. Yeah, we win. Beautiful. Oh, very nice game. This is worth the bot. The worth, worth the bot matches. There we go. But I believe that was like the fourth match. So I'll be back with the last one. So yeah, I'll be doing one more. So give me a sec. Okay. Nice. We have the last player on the line here. Uh, this team. Oh wait, no. This guy backed out. If I do remember last time, don't back out, Adrian. No, I think it's a different. You you're using a different the same team of the guy that backed out last time, but. It's not you, so that's good. He could honestly just freeze freeze me, which is probably what he might do. Hmm. Or he could just rush a melee ult, honestly. Rush a melee ult, I dare you. Okay, you're not. I'm assuming a freeze on my stance. Yep. Then attack into Escanor? Okay. No damage. Like, literally no damage. Freeze Escanor, wow, okay. Well, you just wasted double freeze cards. Honestly, I just want maximum draw. This will give me Arthur ult, so you'll probably have to freeze me or stun me. Is he gonna get Escanor ult? That's the that's the thing. Oh. Okay, he's probably gonna stun. He probably merge a stun. Oh, a shield. Okay. Honestly, let's do this. We break the shield and hopefully we crit and do some decent damage on Liz. Yeah, okay, fine. Nice. We have ultimate next turn and there's nothing he can do, I think. He doesn't have the damage to kill me and he can't stun me. The best he could do is freeze my uh, Arthur. But I'll just one-shot his Amelia twice with my ult. Hmm, yeah, I want Amelia's a threat because she has a secret technique damage. Please freeze my, uh, my Arthur. You'll probably freeze my Arthur, huh? Oh, you're going for the kill on Arthur. Nice, you didn't kill. Good. Please tell me you didn't do it. Nice. Okay, we... Oh, oh my. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. This is the move. This is the move. All right, we. I think we win. 
100%. We ult you, that kills you once. We ult the Amelia, that kills you 100%, and then we taunt up. Uh, this is the bag. We have detonate damage, so additional damage per gauge, and she has full. Yep, easy 152,000 damage. Escanor one-shot this Amelia, so not only will we kill her once, she won't get rezzed, and hopefully we kill Escanor. Kill Escanor. Nice. Okay, we win. Good. All right, good game to Adrian. We we pulled that back. Nothing you can do now. I mean, you could just heal, but that's fine. Your main DPS is gone. Yeah, I mean, you have lost me, but what's he gonna do? Oh, okay, that was good. That was good. Good match. All right, this is this is a nice. This will be a nice ending uh, or finishing game. Yeah, the team's doing what it's supposed to do. Who are, you, who are you going, Arthur? Are you afraid of Arthur? I don't. I don't know. Oh no. Actually, can I rush ult? You know what? I'm just gonna play it safe. We'll do that. Give me a merge. Give me a merge. Please don't tell me he can rush Lost Fane Ultimate, please. Nice, he can't. Good. Going for Arthur, the smart choice. Stunning Escanor. Oh, that's actually perfect. I wasn't even gonna get this. I didn't want to like just move his cards around because that would be a huge waste. But yeah, he messed up. So now I could easily just waste these without, without feeling bad, and I get Debo from Unity next turn, which I will for sure ult your uh, your Lost Vein. I don't care about Liz. You can keep healing all you want. You're not you're not gonna survive. Yeah, stunning my Escanor, but nah, it's nice. Debuff immunity for the win, please. Thank you. Alright. Please take it. Please take it like a champ. No! Why'd you leave? Oh. I mean, I know why, because he was going to get ulted, and we're going to get the nasty double kill with Escanor ult. But there we go. We win. A decent way to end off the video. There you guys have it. Excalibur Arthur with uh, 11. Uh, granted, 11, she... When she, she, we, we, didn't, we, didn't, we didn't really use her that much, but she still did massive damage whenever we did ult with her and did attack with her. But the purpose was uh, to show off the full human team again, and it worked. Not only did our HP have a, a massive increase of 30%, we also had a 20% extra damage dealt. Pair that up with 11's damage increase with her passive, and she just hits insanely hard. As you saw there, when we did ult with her and when we did attack with her, she did massive damage, especially if she crit. Do the death pierce and then the one you already need you already you don't even need any explanation for the one as to why he popped off he's one asking or come on yeah there you guys have it hopefully you guys enjoyed again if you're new make sure to subscribe currently on the road to 900 subs leave a like on the video if you did enjoy and comment down below anything you want to talk about regarding this team or anything really and that'll be it for today thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace